Hey there, Super Kids, and welcome to Super Kids, your number one source for youth fitness and wellness. My name is TJ, your in home personal trainer, and it's right here where we work out together in our own living rooms. Now, boys and girls, get ready because in this particular Pilates session, we have a wonderful, fantastic, amazing Pilates instructor named Jessica Schatz who will be instructing you on exactly what to do in these videos. Now, boys and girls, get ready because you will be using the following items. A pair of socks. Ooh. Two soup cans. Yeah. And your water bottle. Make sure there's water in that water bottle. Hey, super kids. Okay, in this Pilates session, we're gonna do a lot of upper body work, okay? And of course, abdominal work. Everything is always about your abdominals working, but we're gonna really focus on that upper body. So, I want you to come down onto the floor, and we're gonna work on a Pilates-style push-up, and you're gonna come into a plank position. So everyone can do this on their toes. So you're holding your push-up position, and you're gonna slowly lower all the way down to the floor. So you're gonna go down slow, 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 slow as you can, slow as you can, all the way, all the way, all the way, and then put your knees on the floor and push yourself back up, okay? Now back onto the toes, and you go, let's count for eight. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And push up on your knees. And tuck your toes again. Here we go. So keep that tummy in. That tummy is really going to help you here, okay? So it's not all on your shoulders. So tummy is really pulled in. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And press up on your knees, flat back, and back onto your toesies. Tummy in. Eight, seven, six, five, four, Three, two, one. Press back up on your knees. We've got one more. You're doing great. So tuck the toes off, and here we go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And press back onto your knees. Good job. So go ahead and sit back on your heels just to give your back a little stretch here. This stretches your shoulders and your back a lot, which feels really good after any kind of push up. So stretch long through those fingers, curl those fingers forward, curl those fingers forward, make them move like little spiders, reach, 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 and come on up. Okay, so now we're gonna grab our soup cans here, and we're gonna stand on our knees, which means this position right here. So I'm standing on my knees, nice and strong in my legs. You can have your toes tucked behind you, or you can have the top of your foot flat. Either way is fine. So. Pull that tummy in, nice and strong. Suck in the stomach. Take your soup cans, and we're gonna do shaving and hug a tree standing on our knees. So, bend the elbows, hands behind your head, cans are touching, tummy in, and you're gonna lift up, keep the cans together, and bend. Even if your arms don't go straight, I want you to keep the cans together. So, I'm pulling in my tummy, I'm strong in my legs, I'm lifting up my arms, Everything is working. Squeezing the tush. Lift and down and lift and down and up. Let's do one more and up and down. Good. Now lower the arms for a second. Now we're going to do hug a treat. So keep this strong stance of the legs and the tummy really pulling in. Open your arms with a little bit of a bent elbow and you're going to close and open, so we're hugging a tree. Close and open, and close and open. Tummy is really pulling in, squeezing the tush, and tall spine, long strong legs, and close and open and close. One more, and close and open and rest the arms. Give your neck a little stretch, just each side. You can roll your chin through go ahead and stretch your neck. Okay, one more here. This is called serving, just like you have trays in your hands, okay? So you're gonna bend your elbows, they're right next to you, I'm still long and strong in my legs, tummy in, and I'm gonna serve the tray forward and pull it back. Right now, it looks like I'm serving soup in their cans, but I can pretend it's anything I want. 
I'm serving up a plate of fruit, and now I'm serving up a plate of veggies, and maybe some pita chips and hummus. That sounds really good. And maybe some almonds and some yogurt. And back, I'm serving that tray, it's whatever you want. And back. I'm nice and strong in my legs, pulling my tummy in, and I go out and in. Everything's slow and controlled, and out and in two more and out and in one more out and in good let's put those two kids to the side that was a lot of good stuff on the upper body let's take a break from that and come onto your back hug your knees to your chest do a little work on our abdominals and take your hands behind your head lift your legs up to the sky now I want you to lower your right leg so it's just off the floor a little bit, not too much, and hold it. And now you're going to take three counts to lift it up on the exhale. Okay, ready? One, two, three. Other side, lower your left leg and exhale. One, two, three. Inhale, right leg down and exhale. One, two, three. Inhale, left leg down and exhale. One, two, three. It's so hard to go slow. You really have to control with your tummy. And down and one, two, three, and down and one, two, three. Last one, down and one, two, three, and rest. Okay, so now we're gonna do that with both legs. If you have any tightness or pain in your lower back, I want you to do it with your hands under your hips and your head down, okay? So I'm gonna show that. You go like this, you go down and you go up, two, three. If your low back is okay, then go ahead and lift your head up in your hands. Okay? All together. Here we go. Inhale down, exhale up, two, three. Inhale down, exhale up, pull the tummy in. Inhale down, exhale, pull the tummy in. Inhale down and one, two, three, and down. One, two, three, three more down. One, two, two more, down, one, two, three, last one, down, one, two, three, and bend the knees, good, hug those knees to your chest, give yourself some little circles, so you're circling the knees around, to give your low back a little massage, and now we're going to circle the other way, around, 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 and you're going to rock and roll up, massage out that spine, and come all the way to standing, and we're just going to finish standing nice and strong in Pilates position, heels together, toes apart. And we're just going to take a nice side stretch. So you're going to lift up and push your hip out and reach and maybe do a few little grabbies with your hand to really get that blood flowing through the whole body. Grabby, grabby, grabby while I'm stretching, stretching, stretching. And up. Oh, that felt good. And up and over to the other side. Reach, reach, reach. And then little grabbies of the hands those fingers, stretch them out, lengthen, lengthen, breathe, stretch, and come up. Great job, all done. Uh, boys and girls, if you got through that Pilates session successfully, give yourselves a nice round of applause. Very, very well done. That was not easy. Now remember boys and girls to drink plenty of water before, during, and especially after exercise. You want to make sure that they're dr drinking little sippies of water, not big gulps, but little sippies. Now, for those of you out there that were not able to complete everything in this particular Pilates session, that is okay because here at Super Kids, all that we really care about is that you just give it your best in every single video that we offer. Now with that said, boys and girls, we've got lots more videos headed your way, so make sure you're checking those out because each and every video is very different from the next. Okay, boys and girls, I have a question. Why in the world was the baseball player arrested? Well, because he was caught stealing bases. <laughs> I'll keep you in your Until next time, goodbye.